हेलो एंड नमस्ते वेलकम टू माय चैनल नेपाल स्टेशन एंड वेलकम टू माय न्यू एपिसोड ऑफ क्रिप्टो करेंसी टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू क्रिएट द वॉलेट फॉर द बिटकॉइन इथेरियम रिपल एंड अदर क्रिप्टो करेंसी विद द गेटअप एंड हाउ टू यूज द ट्रेड ऑप्शंस विद द गेटअप एंड आल्सो लाइक हाउ टू एक्सचेंज बिटकॉइन इनटू इथेरियम एंड इथेरियम इनटू बिटकॉइन एंड वाइस वर्सा विद अदर क्रिप्टो करेंसी अवेलेबल इन द मार्केट सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड into the getup.net make sure it's github.net so basically getup is used for the ripple wallet and ripple is also a, a cryptocurrency which is now widely used for the cross border transaction with the biggest bank like standard charter bank so let's create an account with uh, getup and i will let you know like what we have there so the basic step signing up make sure that you don't use the regular password here so you should have some strong password so that somebody can't hack and the basic captcha things so once it get verified sign up and make sure that you have this recovery key quite safe somewhere uh, it's something like the wallet id that uh, in blockchain wallet i told you like you should you should have this recovery key safe somewhere so that you don't lose it if you lose your password or in, if somebody hacks your uh, email or whatever so if you lose this recovery key you are not going to get your wallet back so make sure that it is safe somewhere in the physical physical place okay let's say yes i have saved it somewhere and then let's check the email you'll see this confirmation email and check your email and activate the account once the email is activated please log in with the email So basically now you have to figure out the <clears throat> we have to complete the account here so we are using it for uh, in individual and there are like quite other options like for the ripple trade user we can like um, start the migration one wallet can be migrated to the next wallet also but uh, make sure that github is the best wallet for the ripple at the moment so um, i'm going to select the uh, so the basic things other basic things that you verify your number um, mobile number and the basic switch so we will get some code here you just get uh, get verified with your number and you just write uh, any name that's for your profile and name already taken so let's okay i don't have any picture okay let's put the nepal station okay make sure that the size is uh, valid there so basically i will skip this process i don't want to put this one and the, for the security concern we you can enable even like the um, the two-step verification from the google authenticator like i was talking about this these things in the previous episode uh, you download the google authenticator and you can enable it like when you go there you're gonna see this code and you scan that code and then every time you enable this code you will get like six unique six digit code and you can uh, get this code here and change the setting so the identity you can update your profile with your uh, documents and everything and if you want to put some contact share so these are the place this is the main place so this is the wallet for the ripple bitcoin ethereum ethereum classics agorip quantum so uh, we have like this eu, EU bank so you can transfer money from bank to the get up through this medium here and even like the other bank details and the mail mail address 
so whichever you want you can put those things there so let's go so the first thing that you have to do is like complete your profile and the second thing is the wallet so basically previously the github used to give you 20 ripple when you open your account but nowadays they are in such a hype that nowadays they they ask you you need to have at least 20 xrp to use this account so basically you need to have somebody who can transfer you the 20 ripple 20 ripple to your address so you can see the wallet address this is the wallet address for your ripple okay so basic things like you go to deposit which one which which font do you want you go to the ripple this is the account that you can transfer to somebody who have a ripple and who can lend you like also where you can give you like 20 ripples so once you have a 20 ripples in your account then you can start playing with your ripple account so basically this is this is how you create the uh, github account and i will show you with my real real github account how to work with this github wallet how to exchange the currency and how to trade with the uh, currency that you have and what are the other things that you can do with so let me log out this demo account and then i will log into my original account so that uh, you would know like how to work with the github account so let's log it out and then i have this two verification code enabled so i will I will log in with um, I need some unique verification code that I have so when you when you log log in from the different browser then you have to author a uh, different browser and different uh, um, different browser and different network then you have to authorize your device from which device you have been logging in so I have to log log it in. Let's see if I have my email here. Let me verify my email. There should be some email from here, so I will allow access for this. now let's log in it will ask the two verification uh two factor verification code again seven six four one so now this is the real wallet that i have that i have uh, my all the profiles has been updated here and the basic home it looks like this one and these are my wallet that you can have a wallet for the repull and you can have a wallet for the ethereum bitcoin and euro wallet so this is like how the home page looks like and i have like this amount of balance with me and go to the wallet so here these are like the recent activities that how we'll receive the wallet um, the money and the currency so basic thing here you can go to the deposit and receive so here what you want to receive is the major thing if you want to receive the ripple then click ripple and you will get your unique identity code if you uh, if you want to deposit like bitcoin then they will give this amount and then you have to deposit the bitcoin on this account then you, then you will get the bitcoin in the github account so if you want to go with the gateway banking gateway but it's still it's unpending so the bank things i i guess like it's also impending and we have a ethereum and ethereum classic and this rip or whatever i don't care about these things so now basically i just showed you like how to get the address for the different wallet and let's go to the exchange so if you have a bitcoin and if you want to exchange it to us dollar or if you want to exchange it to ripple or if you want to exchange like ripple into bitcoin this is the place the exchange is the place make sure that what you want to re what do you have with you at the moment so i have a ripple with me if i want 
my ripple into US dollar, then I will just select, let's like, say, all available. If I put the all available, all available, so I have like 1891, something like that, but the charge, they have deducted the charge. So if I want to exchange it, then I can unlock it with the password, but I don't want to do that one. So similarly, if you want it to be in Ethereum, let's say, uh, if I want to use the all ripple into Ethereum, then let's. So this is where like you can exchange XRP Ethereum. So once it get locked, unlock, but I don't want to do that one too either. So and also. And if you have like suppose if you have a Bitcoin with you and you want to exchange it to um, Ethereum uh, XRP just flip it around so now if you have some Ethereum or Bitcoin you just put one and then you will get the estimated value of XRP here and then you can exchange it right from here so it's pretty easy like if you have any kind of currency then you can just turn it around turn it around in the github and the next thing is the trading so the basic thing here is this is the live chart and what do you want to do here so you want to buy ripple or let's say if you want to buy ripple and if you have a US dollar so you can buy here you can put the amount that how much you want to how much ripple you want and how much US dollar like if you want to flip it around then you can flip it around like this way like how much uh, amount of XRP you have and how much uh, US dollar you want to buy and you just pay it in US dollar and then buy and it will be in your account so this is the basic things and also here you can even give a limit here you can open the trade if price goes to this amount then sell it if price goes to that amount and then you buy it so these are the basic things then i just don't want to do any kind of trade at the moment but these are the place where you play around selling and buying you are you just have to look around this chart and decide like whether you are going to buy bitcoin or you are going to buy sell bitcoin or you are going to buy ripple with the bitcoin you just look around the chart and you just put the designated amount how much you want to buy and how much you want to sell so basically that's how you do the trade there and that's how you um, that this is where you do the exchange between the currency so it's something like the currency exchange and this analytics part is some something like uh, you have to see like this is the chart for like um, USD versus ripple and euro versus ripple btc versus ripple so basically you just see like ripple everywhere because this wallet is specially made for ripple so this is all about like um, github how to open the account with the github how to access how to deposit um, money in the github wallet uh, just make sure that you need to have a 20 xrp before um, activating your account so make sure that you have some friend who can transfer you 20 xrp or like you can buy um, xrp somewhere in polonex and transfer it to your github amount account and then you can activate other wallets so friends this is all about github and trading trading and exchanging bitcoin bitcoin and other cryptocurrency with the github so I hope that you guys uh, got the idea like how to create the wallets and how to exchange and how to trade with the GitHub. Um, and if you like uh, my video, don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. And stay tuned. I will be coming up with the more episode of the cryptocurrency and the trading options with the Polo Next and how to buy uh, cryptocurrency using other different exchanges. And till then, stay tuned. And I'm signing out from Nepal Station. See you on the next episode.